I'm Poppy and I'm an engineer in the new nuclear technologies. So I started working in mechanical engineering and then I got involved in a project looking at the digital roadmap for a company working in fusion and how they can work on the technologies and the way they manage data today to enable their future vision for the next 10 years. I'm now studying an MSc in computer science part-time to enable me to grow that sort of digital side of my career as well as continuing on with some of the more mechanical parts. I'm really enjoying being able to explore both sides of the business and work with people on more traditional design problems as well as looking at how we can innovate in the future. We are applying the same ideas, the same technologies or the same innovations to a huge range of projects and really interesting, really critical projects, whether that's infrastructure, whether it's transportation or whether it's energy and power, which is more my space. Sellafield's a really good example of a digitally forward nuclear site. They're looking at how they can use robotics because there's a clear advantage and if you can take people away from dangerous sites, then that's a great solution. So I think we're solving real world, very tangible problems, but we're using very innovative, very cool data and, and interesting innovations. I think it's a really exciting field to work in. There's just so many possibilities and we're just discovering what we can do with it. There's a lot of technologies and processes that are really new in general. And there's a lot of stuff that's, that's maybe older that we're now taking on in the engineering field. Sometimes digital projects are slightly more intangible when you're looking at uh, innovations and good thought leadership but it's really great being able to see how we get from that higher level down to actual practical things and seeing that in implementation and seeing it actually impact people's day-to-day -day lives.